What up, peace? Y'all know who it is. Jake Torrance, a.k.a. Jake, Jake. I love you. Let me say that one more time. Jake, Jake. A.k.a. Little motherfucking Tony. Double salute, Pops. Uh. A.k.a. Mr. Health and Wealth to take care of yourself. A.k.a. Motherfucking the fit, Pat Pat. Let's go, man. Hey, check this out, man. I want to talk to y'all real quick about sacrifice and working. Uh, me, myself, man, I work afternoons, right? Most of the time I'm working from two to two, which means, which means during the school year, school season, if you think about it, when I'm going to work, my kids is in school, right? When I'm getting off of work, they sleep, right? Same thing with my wife, she works day shift, right? So how do you sacrifice the time, man? Especially if you're working, you know, I run, I, 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 I do two, two jobs. I run the business before, during the daytime, then I come to work. And then, you know, where do I find time? Where do you find time? Um, how big is the sacrifice you know, I've got a son that's uh, in the playoffs right now. He's a senior at Maslin uh, High School. Uh, I haven't been able to go to none of his playoff games, man. They, his playoff games is on Friday. Uh, Fridays, I'm at work from 2 to 2. I remember going through this stretch with my daughter. I just started back working here. I was a supervisor. I'm still a supervisor, but I was supervisor here for six years, ran this whole plant on afternoons. And I can remember... Uh, Literally having to take goddamn vacation days, vacation days to go see my daughter's ba basketball game. You know, just in order for me to go spend time and see some, see my daughter. Because it's very important to me. But what's even more important is to provide, you know what I'm saying, for your family as a man, you know. You, that'll bring you down if you can't provide the things that your family need and deserve as a woman. You know what I'm saying, as a man or a woman. You know what I'm saying, it's, you know what I'm saying, you got pride and you got, it's, you got, you know what I'm saying, confidence in yourself to be able to do these type of things so for me yeah it hurts man my daughter i haven't seen none of her basketball games yet it, I, I, it was hard for me to catch uh her volleyball games man you know i couldn't unless she played on the weekend that's gonna be like this you gotta figure my daughter just now starting high school man she in the sports high school sports all these sports is played during the week all her games is played during the week, unless she go to the playoffs or summer basketball games be on the weekends, I think. But what would you sacrifice, man? Would you, you know, this afternoon shit, two to two, man. I can get off at 10 if I want to, and some nights I do, man, just when I feel like it's been too long, man. When I feel like me and my wife is ain't spending enough time together, you know what I'm saying, the past couple weeks, or if I feel like uh, me and my daughter, if I, if I feel like she need me to a certain time. I try to get up in the morning and take her to school, you know, two o'clock in the morning. I get off at two. A lot of times I'll get to bed to three thirty, four o'clock. You know, I try to jump right back up at seven thirty, man, and take her take her to school. Most times I'm able to do that, but sometimes, bro, I'm just so fucking tired because that's my little my little sleep time is probably three to four hours a day, man, four and a half maybe. Then I'm right back up and at it, man, all day long, literally. You can ask my wife, man. Uh, the hours and shit that I get up and work, man. Uh, you can ask anybody, man. Shit, the people that know me. Uh, I'm literally down at that motherfucker center at goddamn 8.30, 8 o'clock in the morning, training clients, three, four, five clients a day, man, every day. So uh, it's hard for me to get up and spend the right amount of time or divide the right, because of course your family should get more time than anybody, right? Except for your workspace, when you're working, working the hours that I work, man, I take this shit very seriously. Because like I said, this is how I provide for my fam my family and provide. This helps me run the business. This helps me do things for the business. This helps me do a lot of shit. And when not only it helps me keep my time occupied and my mind occupied. Because y'all know I got, you know what I'm saying, if I get down too long, I'm going to get down. So I want to know, man, how important is it to you to sacrifice, uh, you know what I'm saying, some of your time from your spouse from your kids, uh, from your relationship period, with, you know, your home uh, with work, man, and business, man. A lot of people's marriages fail. A lot of people's uh, ain't in the best place with their kids behind working too much and doing too much. You know what I'm saying? And I don't ever want to fall into that place with my kids, man. So uh, what I'm trying to do, because the last time it got bad, man, last time I just, I got, I got into a hole where 
I didn't do shit but work. Me and my wife wasn't spending no time together. This is all I gave a fuck about. I didn't care about, uh, I did care about the game, missing my daughter's game. But like I said, I would take a vacation day every now and then, but shit, that wasn't really, uh, I, I wanted to go see her play, but shit, I was trying to get back to work after the game. You know what I'm saying? So this time when I started back, you know what I'm saying, they taught me back, man. My, my, my old boss called me back, man. He gave me an offer that I couldn't refuse to take this motherfucking job again. And at the same time, I was, the personal training thing was cool, but a lot of people back out, man. A lot of, a lot of issues with that. So I was making ends meet, but I wasn't able to do the things that I, uh, extra shit that I like to do with me and my wife and the kids and shit. It was kind of tight, you know what I'm saying? So I was like, fuck it, I'm gonna go back. You know what I'm saying? But now I'm in the dilemma again of uh, finding that quality time, man. Me and my wife, I, I, I told myself, I promised myself this round, I'm going to make a, a motherfucking extra effort to make sure that I spend time with my wife and my kids, man, because I don't want to fall back into a place where they hardly seeing me. I'm, we rarely talking. It's just not a good place, man. So I just want to know, what would you sacrifice and how much do you sacrifice and how important is a sacrifice for your business and work? And uh, I know that, you know, if you try to run a business, you got to work 16 hours, 18 hours a day just to fucking, for years, just to put your business on the mat, just to get it going, just for people to even see your vision. I'm two years in, man, and I'm just now starting to see some results from the business as far as like people watching and responding and, and doing shit. Just now, minimal result. I got a good three more years to go, man, before I feel like I could even, you know what I'm saying, a hard-ass work, you know what I'm saying? I'm looking forward to it, but what would you do, man? What would you sacrifice? And how much would you sacrifice? How important is the sacrifice to you, man? Like, share, subscribe, man. It's your boy, J.J.